Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip, we want to learn how we can share an IDU file between several users with Photon Network. Okay, let's do this. Uh, the process is uh, we need to uh, convert the, our IDU file to the array of bytes and then send those bytes with the Photon RPC message system to the other users and after that convert the bytes to the audio file. For decoding and encoding audio file, uh, I used Unity Wave. You can download it, uh, the script of it, Wave Utility, from GitHub, the uh, Deadly Fingers, Unity Wave, here. Uh, this is the system for, uh, as you can see, two audio clip convert the uh, bytes to the audio clip or convert the audio clip to the list of the bytes, to array of bytes, sorry. And then we can use it for uh, sending and receiving uh, these bytes with RPC messages. Okay, uh, for doing this uh, project you need to have Photon Network plugin which is free, you can download it from Asset Store. And for example in here I made uh, an example in the Photon, Photon Unity Networking demos Pan basic uh, basics tutorial and scenes and for two users because I already used just for two users for example you can expand it for many users you want it, there is no limitation for that but for my test I test it with two users in room for two I create an empty object I called it ADU share in here and it has uh, ADU source and Photon view. You can uh, add this component, just write photon and add the photon view in here. And, and this is our uh, system for uh, sharing the voice. But before that, you need to make sure in the wave utility, uh, which is you have uh, uploaded, uh, you have downloaded from that GitHub and uh, imported to your project. Let's to open it and change the cost const int black size underline 16 bit to 4 number 4 by default is it it is one number 2 but it's it's better to be number 4 for better uh, quality of our voice in especially in the converting process okay let's see what uh, what is exist in the what is inside the share ADU? We have using uh, photon.pan, and after that, there is three met, uh, variables: internal array of bytes, final clip bytes. These bytes are which we want to share after we convert them. And this is clip audio clip clip. This is our target uh, audio clip which we want to convert and send. And this is our audio source, and also the photon view, which is uh, uh, usable for uh, sending the RPC message. We have two functions. Uh, first, share audio system and RPC share audio system. It's a, uh, it has to, it needs to have upon RPC before the uh, definition of the function. In here, we call a function from wave utility which called wave utility dot from audio clip. In parentheses, the name of that clip. Okay, and uh, this function try to convert the audio clip and, and uh, put the result as a final clip bytes. And after that, we will call this function of RPC photon view our photon view dot rpc and it has to be the exact name of this function rpc share audio system this is for receiving message rpc shared audio system and this is our target of rpc for example it's all and finally 
uh, our variable which we want to share these uh, this array of point points final clip points and here in the receiver system we have an internal variable it's called IDU data which is array of points and in here uh, I wrote the length of audio data which is uh, uh, useful for understanding uh, how much uh, uh, the, and the length of our array will be and uh, you can you know uh, detect your voice or your sound uh, which is uh, ready to send or not and also in here we need to create an empty audio clip and now we have our bytes let's to convert the bytes and create an audio clip convert the audio clip to an audio clip uh, wave utility dot to audio clip these are bytes and uh, as you can see in the variables it is the offset sample it's supposed to be zero i put it one just that's it and in here you can write any name you want I don't know I put it tell is G for you can do uh, you can write whatever you want and after that now you have your audio clip which is received from pawn so you can use it for everywhere you want for example I create uh, my uh, audio source and say audio source dot clip equal this new clip has been created and let's play it okay our process is ready to use let's come back to the editor and now I want to export an exe from this scene okay I want to test with both uh, applications first my exe and also my editor at the same time okay now it is ready and in here I write I wrote my name uh, my wife's name <laughs> honey and play and in here I play this one and I wrote my name Apple fast perfect now I want to share the voice of victory <laughs> That's it. The first one was from my Unity and the second one was from my Exe. Perfect. Now I want to share something else in here. In here I uh, I've added two uh, uh, other cl audio clips which, you know, which and this one was the first one, the victory. And now I want to share this five second and I click on audio share and drag and drop the and uh, tell is G five second the uh, the duration bit and uh, of this clip the victory was uh, two second it's almost three seconds something like that and now I want to share this one with five seconds That's it. It works. First one, uh, first clip was from my Unity, and second one was from my Exe. And now I want to share the two seconds. And share. Perfect. It works well. Okay, let's stop the 
exe and let's talk about uh, the difference between victory and tallies you 12 seconds and tallies you 5 seconds the victory is the default settings uh, has default settings of uh, audio clips in the unity which is Warbis, the compression format and quality 100 as you can see the size of import size is 37 kilobytes so no need to compress anything because you know if you add anything more than these numbers as you can see in here for example 400 more than this uh, the photon can't send the uh, this array by one message so you will uh, you will see something you sent but it doesn't receive to the uh, RPC receiver so uh, you need to manage your audio clip for example this one because it has just almost three seconds so it is not big deal so no need to compress your audio clip but for example for five seconds you need to compress your audio clip for comp uh, compression uh, process you need to click on Vorbis and decrease the quality to 10 and after that change the override sample rate in here by default it is 40 and 44.100 but now you need to change it to which number what number you want for example I added uh, 11.025 Hertz okay and look at the size it is 26 kilobytes if you change it to 22 and change it it is bigger something it is 44 it is bigger but for my test it was fine with I don't know 11 okay for 12 seconds because it is huge it is bigger than others so I had to change it to 8 uh, 8,000 Hertz the last one the first one sorry and change the word base and convert it to 10 okay look at this it is 47 kilobyte now it is better to send okay uh, this tutorial is finished I hope this uh, these kinds of tutorials will be helpful for you on my YouTube channel you can find out this uh, tutorial as well how you can uh, save and load your uh, audio file as a bytes in the memory by player proofs not uh, as a file in on your storage it will be very useful for your uh, storage size and uh, you know sharing and saving and loading the audio files and don't forget to subscribe like and comment on this of this video have a great time bye bye